For many, the idea of applying social media, you know, tools like Facebook, Twitter, LinkedIn, for business purposes, seems to be a colossal waste of time and money. Listening to the so-called experts, you'd think social media could solve all our problems, including curing cancer. Well, we don't believe that. In fact, you don't need social media if you can already do these two things. First, you already know what your customers, prospects, suppliers, competitors, even regulators, said about you and your business as early as this morning. And second, you have the ability to respond in the here and now with exactly what your customers need. If you're lacking either of those two needs, strategic use of social media may be the perfect way for you to fill those deadly gaps. Once you have the capacity to instantly listen and respond to your marketplace, all kinds of good things can happen. But I thought you might like an example. Okay, we already said we don't believe that social media can cure cancer. But what if someone falsely accused your products of causing cancer? The three-minute video that follows shows exactly how an international company used social media to listen to the conversations about them and respond instantly. Maybe social media can't cure cancer, but you'll see how it can enable you to participate in important conversations about your business and even cure the cancerous messages that can spread through your marketplace like a horrible disease. Here it comes. Keep watching. Imagine you sell stone. You're the market leader. You have operations on five continents and you're the number one supplier of granite counters to over 2,000 Home Depots. One morning you wake up to the headline, what's lurking in your countertops? You find numerous articles claiming your products contain radioactive radon gas. Within hours, the story spreads to blogs, newscasts, and forums. All the success you've had is in sudden jeopardy. What do you do? You could cross your fingers, hope it goes away, wait for someone to save you, or offer a huge discount. But you don't do any of those things. Instead, you face the challenge and overcome it. Innovative Stone turned to their agency of record, Kleber and Associates. Kleber jumped in, uh, worked with us over the weekend uh, to deal with the issue, and although it wasn't uh, a written word for word within our contract, they stepped up and performed um, brilliantly. K&A, armed with EPA scientists, Harvard professors and consumer reports countered the junk science being used in the mainstream stories. They monitored the channels of the communities, employing social media that they were involved in every day to identify and engage in over 500 conversations. Within 24 hours, KNA had also launched a blog, drafted a corporate statement for Innovative Stone's customers, wrote fact sheets for the media, and contacted over 20 industry specialists to discuss and engage in the conversation. Soon the tide was turning. Stories continued being posted with more accurate information, and the EPA confirmed that granite countertops pose no significant health risk, further undercutting junk science. The resulting success was proven almost immediately. Frantic calls of panic never came. Innovative Stone didn't lose a single order, and news headlines publicly confirmed the product's safety. Innovative Stone continues to collaborate with the Home Depot and has strengthened their position as the number one supplier of branded granite countertops in the U.S. When I came to Innovative Stone, having worked for DuPont for about 17 years, um, Innovative had very little experience with an outside PR group. Um, when I joined Innovative, uh, I had brought with me some experience um, through my work at DuPont with which mostly larger PR groups. Uh, Innovative was um, really a, a growing company at the time and really looking for more of a uh, mid-level um, PR group that, that firmly understood the kitchen and bath industry. And we had interviewed several companies, but in Cleaver we found a firm that had a, a, a very good understanding, a very deep understanding of the kitchen and bath industry. And uh, we began our relationship, as I said, about a year ago, and uh, it's been absolutely great.